All right, we're on the hunt. Welcome back, guys. I'm Lord the God Slayer, I'm really gaming. We are on the hunt for the next boss, Beatrice the Taylor. Rogue 93. Need that. All right. <clears throat> All right, we're looking good. We're looking good. <clears throat> we lucked out on some on some good blood there. All right, let's first and foremost. We're heading this way. All right, <clears throat> Beatrice the Taylor. If if the uh. If the is she in here? Okay. If the description says it correctly, she is a vampire. Oh wow! Hold on. She is of the of the dark blood. We're gonna find out. We're definitely gonna find out. <clears throat> We've got new weapons. We've got some iron stuff. Oh no. Okay, so. Okay, so she's obviously around. No time for y'all. You gotta go. You gotta go. Good blood, full health, new iron weapons. Feeling pretty confident here. We don't have any armor yet, but the only reason why we don't is because I'm having to, uh, ah. Uh... There we go. There she is. Okay. Okay, there she is. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Alright. This little healer. So she's here. Okay. There she is. Two arms! 
That's crazy. Ah! No. In my previous video, I was trying to show you those girls up there in that group. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> All right, let's see if we can get her. See if we can get her home. Oh, wow. Can't transform. We have followers. All right, let's see if we can get her home. I'll show you guys um, if she doesn't die I'll show you guys the process in which you by which you you obtain Oh, 
killed her. But yeah, you would bring her back home if you wanted uh, a particular person, you would bring them back to your home that way. <clears throat> but you would bring her home and then you would put her in the coffin and you have to wait like an hour and 30 minutes. And then they would come out of the coffin a vampire. All right. However, we have, we have achieved our goal, our main goal here. Um, it would be best to actually do that, that type of, uh, it would be best to do that kind of hunting with somebody. <clears throat> that way you can have the other person kind of protect the path while you, uh, take the person with you. Of course the sun rises but Beatrice was actually a lot easier than I thought uh, I didn't think well the only thing that made her made her any difficult if there was difficulty it was the fact that she was inside of a whole damn town and uh, I think that's the reason why now you get the uh, we get the human form t uh, technique with her is because she's a vampire but she stays as a human most of most of the time and she's a tailor that everybody loves so I guess nobody knows she's a vampire except for us mingling with the mingling with the enemy over here mangling with the enemy All right, we made it home. Let's take a look at what we got. <clears throat> All right, so what we have here, we have human form. In grandma form. <laughs> Basically, same thing. Okay. Yeah, it's basically the same thing. Grandma form. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's put our human form on right here. There we go. What else we got? Okay, so apparently what we got from her was mainly the form itself. <laughs> yeah, the form itself and then the ability to create the loom. That'll give us the ability to make yarn. Okay, so we can go ahead and pop that up. We can go ahead and pop that up. On the tailor outfits the tailors and stuff so now we can actually make uh what we need to make our armor now and as you can see i got the floor looking nice and nice and foragey for the forest bonus thanks guys for watching we just took out beatrice the tailor we're on the next level now of our gear grind to continue on getting these bosses done getting more abilities and stuff i'm gonna let the god slayer i'm really gaming we out